Hi everybody. Today I'm going to show you how I made my cute iPod case. I also want to share with you some of the benefits that music has on your mind and your health. have a pattern to follow when I made my iPod case. I made it up. When I was thinking about what I wanted, I was thinking about what I wanted to use it for. I really wanted a band that went around my arm so that when I exercised I didn't have to hold my iPod. I also knew that I wanted to have a little place to put my earphones. And I wanted it to look cute. And I think it looks pretty cute. <laughs> now I could have bought anything at the store, but I really wanted to make it myself. Now I haven't had a lot of skills in sewing. In fact, I don't even have a sewing machine. And that's why you see me doing a lot of my sewing by hand. But what little bit of skills I had, I could create anything. And that's what I want you to see, that you could use your imagination. And no matter what you want to create, you can do it as long as you put your mind to it. At the end of the video, my husband and my kids are going to demonstrate to you some of the really cool ways that you could actually use this iPod case. Because it's not just functional on your arm. You're going to need lace, buttons, scissors, and you're going to need something to line it with. I, I like to save my old envelopes that I get in the mail, and I like the ones with the plastic around the outside so that if it gets a little bit wet, it's going to protect it. This is what I'm going to use. It's just a piece of foam and I want to try it. I want to see if that'll work real good. But I had made a foam cover out of this and it worked out perfect. You're going to need pins. You're going to need a needle and thread. I'm going to use a clasp. Fabric glue. This stuff works great. Velcro material. You're going to want a hook to hook on to your clip. You're going to need an iron and an ironing board. And that's all you're going to need. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to get my iPod and I'm going to measure the piece that is going to be wrapped around it to protect it. And I had already done that. I already cut my material and I measured it to go around this. Because this is going to be behind the material. Like this. It will be just like that. Now I also wanted to do something for my earphones and that's what I did here. I measured it so that it would fit on the front of it like this. And then I kind of made an accordion so that when I sew it on there it'll be like a pocket. And I'm going to make the flap fold over top of both the earphones and the top of the iPod. The next thing I'm going to do is iron my material so that they will already have nice creases in them when I go to sew. I sewed 
so this at this end. Now I'm sewing up. And I'll sew this all the way down to get to the end. Now I folded this under and I'm folding this under here. And I'm going to sew this. See, that's going to be pretty even. I put a pin in it so it would be easier to hold together so I could sew it. So I'm sewing the end. This is where you're going to put the iPod in. See, I sewed this all up. Now I'm going to put my pocket on here. But the first thing I need to do is because I took my pocket and I doubled the material on it. I'm going to sew both sides together. I'm going to sew it all the way across and then we're going to sew it on our iPod holder. I only sewed this right here along that side. I'm going to sew from here around just wanted to be sure that you didn't sew the top. I already ironed this part, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go with that seam that I had already made with the iron. And I'll just sew right here across until I get to the very top. Here's the pocket for the headphones. Now, the next thing I want to do is put a button on because I want it to look cute. The next thing I'm going to do is my arm piece. So all I need to do is sew down this seam and fold and sew this. But with this extra piece that I have, I'm going to fold it under like this and make a little loop so that I can put it on this so that I can put my hook on that. I re-ironed everything. I'm only going to sew this and this together, not this. You go behind that stitch and go to the front and pull it through. I have heavy duty thread that I'm going to do this with. Okay, now I'm going to show you what I did. I wanted something to hold my iPod on. What I did was I sewed two loopholes on the back. On my arm holder, I sewed a piece of material and I put a hole in it for the button. I didn't trust that Velcro would hold it on to my arm very well, so I wanted to make sure that I sewed something that um, would hold it on. What I want to do is decorate it and put my Velcro on. I have my fabric glue. I want you to know, when I bought this, I did not realize that it said it's not for fabric. But that's okay. It's a heavy duty Velcro and I am going to put fabric glue on it and I think that it will be just fine. So I put one piece here and one piece here. This is going to be the top. Okay. And then we got to flip it over. And I put one piece here and here's my next piece. This will be the bottom. And there you go. Now we're going to let this dry overnight. And there you have your iPod case and your armband. And that's it. That's all you have to do. Now here is some of the things that you could do with your new iPod case. This is how to put the iPod case on the arm piece. There's these little straps on here and you put them through the flap. Now you button the hole on the flap into the button. Then you just 
put it on your arm. You can put it on your belt. I'm going to show you how you can use this as a necklace. Take a regular pink shoelace, obviously, <laughs> and you tie a knot, just a regular old knot. You know, you guys know how to tie a knot. Just, just like that, over and under, tie a knot. And then, look, make a simple necklace. And then you take this uh, clip of your choice, whatever clip you're using, and you clip it on, and there you go. You can also clip it on your belt loop, and you can stick it in your pocket so it don't fling everywhere. Glad you joined me today. I hope to see you again soon. You have an awesome day. See you next time. Bye. This is how to put the iPod case on the arm piece. You take the little flap and you put the iPod case. No. I don't know. My family offered to wear my pink... <laughs> the, way you, the way you approach me, this ain't right. This ain't right. <laughs> and it's pink. I know, that makes it funnier. <laughs> okay, go ahead. Oh, I can't do this. I don't think I can do it. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. My husband is such a good sport. <laughs> that looks good.